what's up, Mercs? It's Joe here with some more Fallout Frost. Last time we made it to the hotel, and today we're going back. So, let's get a move on. Now, before we actually head off back towards the hotel, I do want to talk to you guys about something. It's been a little while since I uploaded any Fallout Frost, Oblivion, or Skyrim, and the reason for this is because I've been busy dealing with IRL stuff. Basically, I got a new job, and I was just getting that all situated, and now that everything is relatively situated, my content should start coming back consistently, so expect to see it start ramping up over the next couple of days, slash week or two, and we should be back to normal eventually. There might be less streams with my new job, but we'll see. Again, my schedule isn't really finalized. Once I have a more consistent schedule on that front, I'll be able to adjust streaming and recording schedules accordingly. Anyway, we're going back to the hotel today. Why? Well, as many of you pointed out, I was very oblivious, and also very distracted, uh, by the ghouls at the hotel. I didn't pick anything up. At least nothing that I could use. I'm out of ammunition. I need a gun. Well, I know the four parts we need to finish our 308 sniper rifle. We need, let me just try and jump over this here. Can I not get up here? Yeah, that's a, that's a big fog cloud there. I want to try and be careful. The hotel's up here, so we can just go this way anyway. We need gears. No, we have gears. We need oil, adhesive, uh, shit. You know, screws. That's another one. There were four of them. One we already have. I think we already have gears, because all together are five. What was the last? Aluminum. Aluminum. That's the other one we need. I've marked them all, but now I actually remember. So, aluminum, screws, oil, and, um... Fuck, I forgot again. <laughs> uh, oh god, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck! Just go, just go, just go! Just run, just run, just run. Oil and, uh, what was the other one again? Shit. Screws. No, screws, oil, aluminum, adhesive. There we go. Adhesive, that was the other one. Fucking hell, man. I don't know. Little individual parts, just, for some reason, I always, it always just slips my mind. So, yeah. That stuff is relatively common, and I'm sure we missed a ton of it while we were exploring, so we're gonna reloot the area now that everything is dead. Uh, well, almost everything, except for the glowing one at the end. We'll just have to avoid him, because he's a little scary, and I'd rather not die. Uh, hopefully this place hasn't, like, respawned or anything. I really highly doubt it, but you never know. Uh, let's just get our grenades ready, just in case that's all we have right now in terms of ranged weaponry. Because we're completely out of it. Ah, never mind. No? I'm glad to be proven wrong. That was... Wait. Did I really miss that? Or did loot respawn? I don't know. Uh, good chance I missed that. Ugh, that's pretty sad. Well, hey, that's why I'm back. Taking your guys' advice. No, I already looted that. I could have sworn I got the money off that table. Wait, searching? Oh, no, man. Did some of them respawn? There might- that might just be the glowing one that I left. I don't know. Well, I'm gonna try and avoid combat while I'm here. Just because I don't want to die. Or get more radiation poisoning. That would be less than ideal. Also, considering I haven't played Fallout Frost in over a week, I'm slightly... Okay, slightly? Let's be real. I'm really fucking rusty. Wait, what? I, really? Remember I said I didn't want to get into combat? I lied. I lied, I lied, I lied. Never mind. I, I was telling the truth. I don't want to go into combat. That's a festering. Why is... Did I not aggro this one before? Or is this a respawn? I don't know. <gasps> don't fall, please. Okay. I need to kill him. There we go. Kill him without using too much ammunition. Duct tape. Adhesive. Done. Alright. Adhesive. Check. Uh, I can't remember how many of what we needed, so we'll just grab as much as we can. But adhesive, we have some of that. Next, we need, uh, screws. We need oil. Oh, no, we don't need oil. I think it's gears that we need. Because we have oil, we have the used oil thing back there I thought I was using. Hmm. Maybe not. I'll look for it anyway. I hear another one. Like, right next to me. So I'm just gonna get that. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. And hopefully not aggro the one that just woke up. Please don't come over here. Please don't come over here. Please stay the fuck away from me. Thank you, pal. Alright. I'm just not gonna kill anything here. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. Or hear me, I guess, because you're blind. 
Yeah, okay, we're good. What was that, two? Okay, I think, uh, whatever. We're out of there, is the main thing. The fact that there are asbestos... Oh, we didn't need any of this. The fact that there are ghouls down here again hints that there might be ghouls upstairs, and if there are... We're not going to be able to get as far as we did before. No way. Typewriter, pretty sure that has screws. Just double check here. Typewriter. Screws and gears, good. Good, good. Screws and gears. Soap, that's oil, alright? Screws, gears, oil, um, adhesive, and aluminum. Aluminum's the last one we need. Out of bobby pin. Fuck. Ooh, a pen. So we need to find aluminum. Hmm. Aluminum's pretty easy to find. I mean, tin cans, you know? But... Hmm. I don't know how common is in here. Again, as soon as I start seeing a ton of ghouls returning around, there is no way I'm going through this again don't like I did before. That was pretty stupid of me the first time, and I'm lucky I found a rat away afterwards. Let me just take stock of my medical stuff real quick. Oh yeah, I have Blight. Let's take that real quick. Uh, I have Rad X. I've got Purified. i got food and water. That's good. Something else, though. I'll we'll collect more Blight as we go. Okay, he's dead. Alright. Just watch it, because they come out of the... Rubble, which is what they do quite often. Okay, you're dead. See, some of them are still dead. I don't know, man. I don't know how it works. It's like some respawn. No, Bobby. Pin. Honestly, the way it works, I don't know how it works, but the way it works is very organic. I like it. Because it's not like, oh, all the enemies respawn. It's like, oh, some more ghouls wandered in. I kind of like that. Actually, no, I, I really like that. I think that's really cool. If that's. Maybe it's not even by design. Maybe all these are supposed to be respawned, and it's just a glitch that they're not all coming back. But hey, even if it's a glitch, I fucking like it. But I doubt it. Tablespoon? Steel. Fuck. Telephones are not... Like, I don't... It's not that I just have, like, aluminum not checked, right? Because aluminum's super common. I would expect to have found it by now. I really gotta get bobby pins. Like, super bad. Okay, so this is where we found the biggest horde of ghouls. Now, I'm pretty thoroughly cleared this area out, so if it's just residual ghouls that I've been finding, this place should be completely clear of them. However, if it's new ghouls, I should be careful. So, we're just gonna assume there are new ghouls here and be as safe as we can. Really? There's a little hole here, but there's nothing in it? I guess I, I can just walk right through the cow traps, huh? Because I do heal, it doesn't matter. But, yeah, I should avoid injury. If I break a leg or something, I'm gonna have to take a stim pack and I'll waste water and ugh. No flashlight still. One day, hopefully, we'll get a flashlight here on the island. Telephone, a little bit of money, bear traps. Disarm. What? What? Wait. What? Where's that ripper again? Hmm. Can't get aluminum from it, so... Whoa. Is that oil? Oil, yeah. Hunter's Note! Did I read this before? Or did I miss this completely? Hunter's Note 2. Yeah, no. This respawned. Places crawling ghouls. Seems like everyone I kill, two more show up. Between that big gear thing and the terminal, I know there's one of those vaults here, but I can't find the damn thing. I'm setting up camp here, and I'll try and push further in tomorrow. So yeah, uh, I don't want to save. I do want to save, actually. Yes, I do. Yes, please. Especially after I come this far. Come this far after I came this far. Oh, here we go. This is what I'm looking for, baby. Coffee pot. I think that has... That's steel. Why do I fucking have steel marks still? God damn it. Uh, cooking oil. I'm just going to grab... Oh, shit. We're overweight. Hmm... These way, holy shit. Yeah, I figured. Cooking pan? That wouldn't be aluminum. Ooh! Drinks and food! Delicious. Uh, coffee tin! That would be aluminum, wouldn't it? Right? Coffee tin? Yeah, that's aluminum. Uh, this is steel. I don't need steel. 
I need more aluminum though. Extinguisher. Would that have aluminum in it? I think it's steel. Yeah, steel. Okay. Uh, a pan is steel, right? Cookie, cooking, pan, steel. Yeah, so that's same with the cooking pot, I would imagine. Take more oil just in case. You might as well stockpile it just in case, you know. I'll, I guess I'll try and be as thorough as possible again. Or, not even again. I don't think I was ever as thorough as I, I could be, at least when it comes to junk. All of these bottles respawn. Holy shit. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful. 152. Okay. Drop the wrench. And the pot. We don't need the pot. The pot's useless to us. Those are just the cow drops. That scared me a little bit, but it's okay. Okay, so let's take stock of what we have here. We have two aluminum. I think we need six. Uh, I could be wrong, but might as well get more than what we need. So. Let's just assume it's six. I think we... Let's just assume it's six of everything. Adhesive and more aluminum. That's what we need. Now, both those things are relatively common. Elsewhere. So, if we don't find it here, which I'm sure we will, but even if we don't, because... Either because it's not here, or because I'm lackluster in my thoroughness, we will get it soon. I don't want to say eventually. I want to say soon. We'll get it very soon. Extremely soon. Like, ridiculous. Like a flash. In a flash. Okay, maybe not that. I don't want to promise too much now. Alright. So this is where the glowing one was. Down here. Get our gun ready. We're not gonna kill it. There's no point in wasting the ammunition. There's honestly no point. Hopefully the other ghouls that were here did not respawn. That would be fucking horrible. Oh god, he looks like he's just a normal one that's still alive. Like, that freaks me out. He looks like he's just gonna stand up. I don't know where the one I left behind is. Okay, it wasn't a glowing one. It was that. Now I remember. It was just a normal festering ghoul that I left behind here. And uh, I tried to get the turrets to kill him, but the turrets were stupid and didn't shoot them in the head. I remember now, it's been a while. Why am I at searching? There's, there is a, there's something. Oh, aluminum can. There's got to be more here that I'm missing. Saucer? Like, uh, ghoul-wise. Just have to be careful when we go downstairs. Again, we have those turrets, but they're fucking useless. They're the worst turrets I've ever seen. Alright. I don't swell. No, 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 no. Bobby pins. Again, I don't know if mines respawn. I don't even remember if there were mines, but spam vats all the way down. Just in case you don't want to die on something stupid. Uh, what the fuck was that? Oh. Stim pack. Nice. Yeah, I don't want to be here anymore. There's a scary, scary ghoul. I see what was triggering my searching. I hear the turrets, and there are no ghouls down here. So we're safe down here, as long as we keep crouching. Dinner fork, steel. I need to unmark steel and I get the chance. Wait, can I do it from here? I don't think so. Wait, can I do it from my inventory? I never actually tried. Um, dinner fork, was it on you? Uh, no. Oh, yeah, I go th into here. Uh, I don't need steel. I forgot about this menu, I never use it. Yeah, so we're still quite short on the things we need, unfortunately. We'll have to go elsewhere for the rest. Which I'm fine with. We got, uh, maybe more than half of what we need. I'd say, yeah, more than half. Boston Bugle, that's just cloth. God, those fucking things, they scare me, even though I know they're friendly. They make a sound, I'm like, oh god, don't kill me. Um... I really don't want to drop any more of that. Do I have anything else to drop, John Quiet, that's useless to me? No, I don't. I mean, yeah, all this stuff has something. Oh, this is a toothbrush. I thought it said toothpaste before, I don't know why. 
God damn it. Fuck it. We'll just drop the bourbon bottles. Let's get out of here. Let's head home. Let's unload all this junk and, uh... Wait, what? Uh-oh. I don't want to go down here. I shouldn't have went down here. What if I die instantly? Oh no. <laughs> I don't know where this is going. I, I, I noticed that there wasn't a hatch. Whenever there's not a hatch, that means there's a load screen. I've got four rounds. Please, whatever it is, don't kill me. Whoa! My FPS just tanked. There's something bad here. My FPS is fucking tanking to 30 if I look in this direction. There's a lot of something. So this is where all the stuff is. Oh. I did miss a lot. Is this what you guys are telling me about? We might have to come back. There's a lot of shit here. I wouldn't mind living here. It's nice. I think there are ghouls. Pretty 90. <gasps> no bobby pins. Fuck, man. Shanka. 99% sure we got ghouls in the other room. There's more oil. Oh, there's got to be a bobby pin in here somewhere, right? Oh, yes. Holy shit, that's good. Three. Mm. Oh, yeah, my FPS drops insanely when I look in that direction. There's got to be something freaky. I'm hoping it's not a ghoul. Okay, it's just the vault. Can I open the vault? No. Are there turret? Okay, so that's the interior of the vault. I shouldn't do what I'm about to do, but I really want to know why it's lagging my game so badly. If I die instantly to something. Hello? Maxwell. Eh, it's just the normal stuff. Okay. It's just the normal AI, I guess. Maybe they're confused that their AI has been, like, turned off. Okay, so there isn't that much down here, but thankfully it's empty, which is what matters. Plus, we have bobby pins now. We can go back upstairs and lockpick, which is very nice. Hmm. hmm. I was expecting a lot more down here, but no, I'm actually pretty happy with it. Com what does Comfy Pillow have? Comfy Pillow has cloth. Yeah, fucking useless. I got money that weighs zero. Why would I want that? Wonder glue? Need it. I did not mean to drop the can. I meant to just drop the bottle. A Braxo cleaner. Hmm. I'll come back for that. Isn't this, uh, this gas canister? No, it's oil. I don't really need more of that, I don't think. Okay. Well. Tin can is not aluminum. Let's get out of here. Uh, I really want to lockpick the stuff upstairs, but my inventory is so full anyway. Does it matter? Nah, I guess I'll do it. Well, um, I'll lockpick some things. Might as well drink while I'm in here, too. Purified water. Yeah, let's take another one. I don't want to drink a Nuka. That will make me a little bit radiated, and I don't want to do that. Not right now. Grilled venison? Uh, I don't really want to eat that. That's really good. I might eat the pot of meat, even though the radiation's a thing. No radiation on the drink, but radiation on the food. I'm okay with that. Hello? Still friendly? Good. Good, good. Alright, let's head back the way I came. Wait, what's this? this does this go to the uh, the entrance then? Going down. Yeah, so this goes so, this goes up. Which is good. Because then I can go back and loot what... Yeah, this is the front desk, right? Good. Good, good. I gotta remember- OH! There's a ghoul in here! Holy shit! <laughs> I almost ran right into the motherfucker. I forgot. I completely forgot that there was a ghoul in there. That would've been bad. Okay. I think there was a locked door... Was it? Yeah, it was in here. Please don't tell me that, like, this leads to just the hallway that has the other locked door. I'm really upset if that's the case. Okay, I have to actually be careful with lockpicks now. 
Here we go. Sweet. Oh, no, it's actual storage. And no one else. <gasps> Money! That's mm, more more lies. I was expecting some good stuff. I'm going to take the, uh, the lunchbox there so I can see how hard it is to make an IED. There's uh, another hmm, typewriter for screws. Nah, I'm going to... I'm gonna hold off. I'm just too high on inventory space right now, or low on inventory space. All right, we got this, which is novice. Doesn't help that I'm horrible at this. I guess it's not that we don't have any perks in it either, but still. Nice. Okay. I get scared every time I open it up. Turpentine. Anything else? Eh, not really. A mop. What does that have that I want? Wait, what? Where is it? Oh, there's a mop have that I want. Mop. Cloth. I need to unmark cloth. Uh, there we go. I don't need cloth. Alright. I'm gonna head back up here. Because if I remember correctly... Oh god, itchy eye. I think there was one in here? Yeah, here we are. This was another novice one. Hopefully I don't break a lockpick on a novice. Again... Oh, you got it. There we go. Yes. Oh, fuck me. There's a... There's... Oh, Jesus. I'm just gonna do this. Really? Did I at least... Okay, I took his legs out. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Sorry. Really need what's in here. Cloth. Empty. What a waste of a fucking grenade. I don't think there's one thing in here that's useful. There's not even a bobby pin laying around, maybe? Really? Oh my god. Fucking useless. Well, I got XP or something. I guess that's something. Alright, there's one more lock I want to go to. I think there's only one more. There's an advanced lock. Uh, where was it, though? I know it was on this floor, I just don't know where. Wait, the caltrops. Don't think... Yeah, that's the broken stairs. I think... Can I cook? Yeah, I can. No, no, that's right, I can't. Uh, I'm pretty sure the advanced lock is in this section of the hotel. Again, we have that legendary right below us, so we want to be careful. But I'm pretty sure it's, like, right here. Legendary being over that way. Yeah, this is it. Alright, two lobby pins. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay, we almost got it. Nice. Got it. Okay, thank fuck. I thought that robot was going to be live. Robot? Robot. Okay, nothing here looks live. This place looks pretty clean for what it is. Bobby pin fucking paid for itself, and I didn't even lose a bobby pin on this one. A little bit of cloth. There's gotta be something like a ghoul in here. I'm getting really freaked out. Vacuum tube. Wait, don't I need a vacuum tube? Oh, shit. That's a vacuum tube for the ship. That's... That's one of the things we need. Wow, I'm actually glad I came back and looted everything. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna need bobby pins then. If something like this is locked by an advanced lock, I'm gonna need bobby pins. I am glad. So I got one part of what we need. I think vacuum tube was definitely on the list of repair parts. I can't remember. It's been a while since the last run, but... Hell yeah, guys! That's fucking awesome. I'm actually surprised. Okay, so the ghoul's below us. We don't have to worry about him, really. I'm gonna look around again, just make sure I haven't missed any locked doors I'm forgetting. I don't think so. Alright, so the ghoul that we want to avoid is right below us. So we're gonna sprint over here. We're gonna sneak down the stairs once again. He's on the other side of this wreckage. We're just going to pop by. Can't even see him, which is good. And now we're safe. Uh, yeah. Relatively. Hello, turrets. What was that? Baby rattle. Alright. Thanks for your protection, turrets. I will see you... Actually, probably not for a long time. I doubt I'll come back. 
that underground area wasn't as lucrative as I was uh, expecting it to be when I first went down. I mean, yeah, there's a Braxo there, but is it worth coming back to this radiated area with ghouls? Mm, no. I don't think so. I think I can find something better in other places. More Blight. I'm going to beat that instantaneously, just so my passive healing can get to work on the damages. Let's see what we got in here. Doesn't look like much. And you know what we're going to do real quick, though, before I forget? Uh, component view. So, adhesive aluminum, screws, gears, and oil. Okay, just making sure that those are the only things marked from now on. Because before, I kind of had, I left things marked because I, like, didn't really worry too much about it. Because I was a jackass. And uh, because of that, I missed things. Because I ignored the little magnifying glass because I'm like, eh. That's probably something that I don't need, because I have it marked, and I forgot to unmark it. Or, I didn't forget, I was too lazy to do it. But, whatever. It's fixed now. It's fixed now. There are ghouls over there we want to avoid. Let's go back, let's store our stuff. I don't think we have the, the parts necessary to repair, or to switch out the... The receiver... Oil. We... Mm, mm, we might be able to. Not for the most powerful one that I could build, though. Maybe for a weaker one. I don't know. We'll have to see. The parts I was getting, I was uh, thinking about ones for the most powerful one that I can build with my current level of uh, gun nut. So let's just pass all the fog. Head into the back. And let's first store everything, grab the sniper rifle, and let's see what we can do. Muzzled sniper rifle, hardened receiver. So, powerful receiver is what I really want, right? That needs... We're, we're missing one screw. I'm not gonna do that. No way. Fuck no. I'm missing one screw. One fucking screw. And I get a... It's a small damage increase, but it's a damage increase. You tell me. There's no screws in this whole place anymore. Also, filters are aluminum. I did not know that. I know that now. Good to know. Wish I knew that before, because I was looking for aluminum a lot, and I was not looking at the filters. Shit. There's really no screws here. There's just one screw? I can't take apart a gun to do it either, because I don't have any, and I don't have scap scrapper. Do I have scrapper? I don't think so. I never got scrapper. Can I even get scrapper? Yeah, scrapper is in six in intelligence. That's not something I can get. <sighs> Fuck, I really... I'm trying to think, where can I get an easy screw? I just need one screw. There, why, why else would I build that? If, I, if I'm one screw off. Like, that's just stupid. So we're gonna go find a screw, damn it. I should have picked up that fucking typewriter back there. I couldn't. I was too heavy. But I should have picked up that fucking typewriter back there. I mean, I guess I could go back and get it, but... I don't know if it's worth getting the, uh, the radiation from going into the area just for one screw. I mean, I guess if I had to think about it like this, I'm going back into that area for my gun. For one gun. With, like, what, eight rounds, I think we have for it? Nine rounds. Oh, wait. We have 50 cal ammo? What the fuck? What? What? When the fuck did we get that? If I would have known, I would have brought the damn gun with us. Oh, my God. Well, we'll get our screws elsewhere, then. I'm going to use the 50 cal ammunition. Before I switch it to a 308. I'll just bring the receiver with me. And then anytime we find a weapon bench, we can switch out receivers. It's only 0.5 to carry an extra one on my back, so I'm not worried about it. Alright. These are all filled up. Let's go ahead and cook them, see how much we get. Hopefully a decent amount. I don't think so, but... Also, someone pointed out... Multiple people pointed out... Um, 
they, they're saying how Nogrim should make it so that when you consume water, it should give you the bottle back, and you saying the coal and all that. Um, you know, there's two ways to look at that, because there are mods that do that. I used to have mods that did that in Fall New Vegas. Not in Dust, though. Uh, think about it like this. Alright, there's immersion and realism, and then there's gameplay. What happens if you have water bottles all the time no matter what? You're gonna have water all the time no matter what. Especially with how easy it is to cook it here. Because all you have to do is get three dirty waters together. In dust, you needed an extra ingredient. You needed something called experimental radex or experimental radaway to purify it. So that was something. But in frost, you just need three dirty waters, right? And because of that, plus you have the weird thing with the crafting recipe. It takes three bottles to make one bottle. What happens to the other bot? Like, it's, it's, that's weird. See, I look at it mostly from a gameplay aspect, though. It's like, it's gonna be way too easy if you, if you make it that way. I mean, maybe it won't be. Maybe there's another mechanic you can implement, like, damage bottles, or, like, make dirty water fucking ba basically useless. Make it so that you drink dirty water, you're gonna get sick. You're gonna get real sick. You know, like, that kind of shit. But, I don't know. Like, you have to balance... You have to balance, uh... Wait, does this have a screw on it? Gear. Fuck! You have to balance... Paint as... No. What am I trying to say? You have to balance, uh... Fuck. Gameplay and realism and immersion. You have to balance difficulty with that stuff. It's not easy to do. At least I imagine. I don't know. I'm not a coder myself. Uh, fuck. There's no screws here. God damn it. I thought maybe. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I thought. I thought wrong. All right. Let's cook up the last of this water here. I think we have enough for one more bottle, maybe. Yes. Good. So now we have lots of water. We also have... Do we have the muzzle on us? Did I put it on us? I don't think I did. No. Let's go and grab the gun. Just to take it with us. Might as well. Also, grab this, because it doesn't weigh anything. Okay, no. Store all the junk. Grab the money. The money doesn't weigh anything. Give me the rifle. Uh... Just in case I find a harpoon gun, I'm gonna keep those. And this is all just doesn't weigh anything. I'll take lunch boxes, weigh something though. I need all that stuff. I mean, most of I mean, I guess I don't need like maybe even blood. I want to keep all the drugs on me though, because it's not a lot and they might save my life sometime. Because when I have very little resources to work with, I need anything I can get. Alright. Good. We are good. And with that, guys, I think I'm going to end. Today's survival here. Thank you to my patrons, The Real Chim Shady and Dr. Shekel for the support. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, check out my Twitter and Discord channel in the description below. And as always, goodbye.